So, back out on the road with RB and we are out on yet another Lexmo Tow Titan and as you can tell from the wind noise it is incredibly cold out today. It's currently about minus one but what better someone has to get out and road test these bikes and uh, try out these tyres in extremely cold weather. So obviously sitting at a nice steady 40 mile an hour running the bike in and visibility is nigh on horrible but at 40 mile an hour not that bad and just coming in on that combined braking and on that rear brake cold day combined braking it does pull you up effectively and you may notice a little bit of a shiver in my voice i have my textiles on i am nice and snug but my wrists and my fingertips are absolutely frozen as i say it's currently about minus one <laughs> and for the purposes of ride testing i've got my visor up as well because i have an iridium screen and i can't see jack with that screen down so hence why the visor is up and I sense a hint of snow in the air as well so obviously if you're using one of these on a very cold morning or you're using it as your daily travel and you're worried about being out in the cold don't be this thing is still planted to the road and everyone knocks the nylon tyres on the scooters and on the bikes but if you remember back in the 70s 90% of the tyres that were out were nylon tyres on the old British bikes there wasn't any old rubber about and obviously these handle effectively enough for me and as I always say if you are in cold weather then slow it down a little bit a little bit slower in the corners take your time them tyres are still going to perform as adequately as what a normal tyre would it's only when you go barreling into corners black ice that you're going to lose a little bit of that front end traction and uh, low side or even high side the bike obviously I test in all weathers and this is extreme today as you can tell from all the fog lights but I'm on a dual carriageway the lights on this are incredibly bright I can see where I'm going the other traffic users can see my rear tail light and I've also got my high vis on as well so not an issue now obviously Euro 5's come in what is happening with Euro 5? It's just tighter emission controls and the Euro 5 bikes have arrived from Lexmoto. All the bikes are now at the dock and Lexmoto are shipping them out. Chucking the bikes out. So hopefully we will start seeing deliveries of new Lexmoto scooters and bikes in the next two to three weeks. And it is getting really, really foggy now. taking our time <laughs> visibility now is down to about I'd say about 100 yards now it's obviously been a lot worse in the mornings than it is in the late afternoon and we've been waiting for sort of some decent slots to get out and ride test these bikes hence the delay in me getting videos up at the moment but I thought what the hell let's just brave it do it tonight get a couple of these bikes out of the way so this is the final ride test on this Titan and just for the customer's benefit just taking it nice and steady and just getting some mileage on it for him so currently sitting about 45 on it just give it a little burst of 45 and then ease it back to 40 but as I say these little Titans are absolutely bomb proof they do the job absolutely perfectly and never have an issue with them so if you are looking at getting yourself a bike over the next couple of weeks obviously with what Covid is chucking back at us again and Boris is doing with the country the lockdown and I've seen so many lockdowns and tears now that it's getting slightly crazy but obviously 
a lot of the bikers aren't going out due to social distancing. All the cafes are all shut down at the moment. I haven't been out on uh, obviously my one. Come on, lights for about three weeks now. And uh, obviously this is <laughs> one of the 125s I tend to be out on a lot at the moment. The Titans, we've got a Michigan coming through at the moment as well. But we have got some big bikes that have come in. So quite a lot of big bikes coming in. Uh, you haven't seen the R1 ride. That R1 that we had in was absolutely crazy. We've now got a Forza, Honda Forza 125 that's just come in. We've got a Sat uh, Peugeot Satellis three-wheeler and we've just taken an MP3 as well, 2011 MP3. So if you fancy a little bit three-wheeled fun. And then obviously we've got all the other big bikes as well. We've got the Daytonas in, we've got the Jixas in. We've got a nice Suzuki Bandit coming in as well. And obviously just listening up and checking my mirrors, I can hear a siren. I think that's going to be the other side of the road. You can see it's coming down really bad now. This fog is getting really, really heavy. Obviously, just keeping an eye on them uh, cars in my rear view mirror. But this little Titan does the job every time. That's coming into my right, so I've got my eye on him. And then obviously back down the dual carriageway again. For the final uh, little run on this test. So what are you doing this weekend? If you are out on your bike, social distancing as we say, getting you a bit of exercise, have a good one. I'm going to crank up some more miles on this. Do a little bit more and then we're just going to uh, wind off and head back to the garage. And obviously cold weather, pushing the bike into the corner at a nice steady 30. It's planted, tyres doing the job. And quick shoulder check, getting us out into traffic. Fog is absolutely coming down like a mad thing. Most little tight and just plodding away like it. I always say these things, bomb proof. That's what it says on the tin, absolutely perfect. We've got quite a few of these in stock at the moment. I've got uh, four of the greys, two of the reds if you are interested in a tight. Obviously this one for the customer, he's got the alarm on it, we've got top box on it. He's ordered uh, quite a bit of bike gear off us as well. So happy days for him, due to get it in the next three to four days. And that is an absolute peace super coming down, so we're going to head back to the garage in a second. So until the next time, if you are into your bikes guys, don't forget the Euro 5s are all coming in. We've got a big stock of bikes coming in. If you're into a second-hand bike, keep an eye on the website. As always, everything found off on my website page, revbomb.co.uk. Go in there, check it all out. All the links for all the garages there. And then, uh, as always, if you don't follow, hit the follow button, like and subscribe to us. Leave your comments in the sections below what you're doing over the next few weeks if you're out on your bikes. Let us know uh, what your best uh, Lexmodo bike is. I like the Titans, I do like the Michigans as well. But I do, I've got a personal love for those LXRs. And until the next time, on a very cold evening, foggy, frozen, and riding a Titan from RB. Have a good one. Until then, it's a big goodbye from me, guys.